I need you to acquire something. Only me, no client. So I expect quick and clean results. You will be entering Tiger Claw territory. Very high risk. More information attached. I just love how I go to these high risk situations for a living. And I'm just very nonchalant about doing things that could potentially kill me. But then again, this is Cyberpunk 2077. Can I expect anything less than that? This is, this is uh, Lover of Ladies. Thank you for tuning in to this week's Cyberpunk. And let's see what this gig is about. A great treasure can turn out to be a great curse. Remember that, V. One of the fences in my territory, Lee Gladen, came into possession of some highly valuable equipment. A lock break device capable of jailbreaking corp cyberware. Some call it a corp cracker. Ha! That's funny. Corp cracker. This tech opens doors for suits who want out but don't want to lose function of corp issued chrome or are looking to make an extra eddy by selling secondhand. Lee wasn't born yesterday. She knows what the tech is worth. She and I went back and forth long price negotiations. We were close to reaching a deal when all contact was lost. How much you want to bet she's dead? Your job is to find out what happened to Lee. More importantly, to get that skeleton key for me. Don't bother reporting back until you have it. Don't waste time. What the hell is this? So the rent is $15,000? And I thought rent in America was worse than that. Shit, I'm good. Um, apartments, I assuming, maybe. I mean, for $15,000, this elevator looks like a piece of shit to me, but... Are you, are you kidding me? How am I supposed to get out? Maybe it's the upper level? Maybe I'm in the wrong floor, so. For the love of. Uh, couldn't I have been stuck in some model skull? Or I don't know, a fucking landscape architect? What is it now, Johnny? Being dragged through roach infested flop houses again. That's what. You should be used Job's to that. A job. Now, what was that code? Uh, two, one, three, seven, so, let me see here, two, one, three, seven. What a fucking shit sty. Wasn't Ooh. slumming it in squats like your whole thing? Sure, when I was skezzed out beyond all recognition. Oh, she liked a lot of Chinese food, that's cool. And I'll take this. I mean, she's not going to eat it. Not anymore. I hear flies. Ugh. Okay, let me see here. So that's the living room. Kitchen. Bedroom. Ew, look at all these cockroaches. Ew. Ew. What's this? Okay, so conversation between Wilbur and Lee. Hey Lee. Hey. So got any eager buyers? Yup. Tigers. Triple my asking amount. Sounds good. Too good to be true. Jealousy? Subbull. Oh, cause I'm filthy fucking rich. Bet your sweet ass I am. But that won't change the facts. This reeks a mile off. In your shoes, I'd rather stick my finger up a cat's asshole than touch this deal. 
Yeah, right. Gotta go. Call you from Hawaii. Nerk. I'll take this gun. She has a TV above where she sleeps? Jealous. The first and most important lesson, you and only you, are responsible for your situation in life. Don't wait for the government to take pity on you. Don't wait for your loved ones to lend a helping hand. Just pull yourself up by your bootstraps and get to work. I know what you're going to say. Unemployment is at 34%. But so what? Wait, unemployment's at 34%? Holy shit. That's insane. What's stopping you from starting your own business? It's that damn simple. What's that? You say you need an education? So educate yourself, for Christ's sake. From now on, I don't want to hear any excuses. What matters is that you can be rich too, but you have to want it. And for that, you have to work for it. Oh my god, this sounds like some bullshit Kim Kardashian would say. Alright, so I'll search here, see what I can find. Maybe these messages will give me a clue. Oh my god, Juanita here. Good, day. Good day, your order is ready for pickup. As requested, steel wheels have been mounted to the bottom of your machine. Please remember that the maximum wheel load capacity is 2,200 pounds. Using the wheels to support more than a specific weight may result in damages. If you have any questions or concerns, do not hesitate to call customer service. Vendo mate. Warning, scam letter. Nah, whatever. Nothing here. Oh, well, well. Secret doors. How cliche. Why do peeps have to be so goddamn predictable? Question is, how can I open it? So, according to the internet there's a secret button in the kitchen right here so this should help must be connected to those doors or a shitter flushing somewhere who knows ah there you go yeah that button in the kitchen is able to open up this secret room right here so Yes, I totally love hacking. Hacking is my favorite of all time. Yay. And I got 400 bucks, so I'm pretty good. Ooh, more messages. Let me see. Make sure you're holding onto something, because I've got something that'll make you fall out of your chair. I've got a pretty piece of tech for sale that jailbreaks corporate equipment. 100% effective on both implants and weapons. Works across the board except for Night Corp tech. Must use another encryption system. Interested? Don't think too long, I have other buyers. I'm buying. Send details on payment and delivery. Looks like me, I went to the Tiger Claws. Behind, Waco's back. Dun dun dun! Tisk tisk tisk. Claws aren't the deal honoring type. Let's see if she got lucky. Kena, I got something for you. A device for jailbreaking corporate equipment. 100% effective on both implants and weapons. Works across the board, blah blah blah, blah blah blah. Holy shit, I'll give three times more than the best offer. Drop by Wired Head and we'll hit the market. Yeah, she's dead. And I'll take this. And then I'll also take this too. Why not? Alright, well, in that case, she's definitely as good as dead because Tiger Claws are a piece of shit. And let's see how fast I can find her body at this point. Okay, so I gotta go to the Brain Dance Club. So I assume that's where I'll be able to either see her or the Tiger Claws. So wish me luck.
I just love the way I park sometimes. In the middle of the street, in the middle of the sidewalk, why not? How's was this? Hey V, you see the news? I'm sort of messaging just to brag about my prize, but also to say thanks. This piece couldn't happen without you. Okay, I'll admit, mostly I wanted to brag. Happy for you, Nance. Nice. That's cool. Alright, so Brain Dance Club is right here. I'll go through this way. And the elevator does not work. Oh, wait. Yes. I don't know what I'm expecting, but I know for a fact I have a good feeling I'm going to end up fighting a lot of people. Because it always happens. Reminds me of this one dive in Arroyo we used to sometimes do sets in Friday nights. Because... Because it was one tough fucking joint. One wrong word, one sideways glance, and you'd get steel between the ribs. Shit. This club's no fucking joke. Do I just hide? Yeah, I have a good feeling. I have to kill a lot of people, so. Alright, number one. Number two and number three. Uh huh. Alright, and number four. Ooh, I told you something bad was gonna happen. Did I not? Oh, number five. It's a nice suit, by the way, but... Who else? You number six? Alright, number six. Number seven? Or seven? I mean, he's not really doing anything, so... Here. Bingo. Huh. And to think so many people died for this tiny little shit speck. It's not the size that counts. Both you and I know no one actually believes that. Yeah, you're right. Ooh, I'll take that, I'll take that. And you must be... Ooh. I took too much uh, stuff. Let me just clear some junk out. I managed to disassemble a couple of weapons that I know I'm not going to use. And it looks like I'll be able to get away. Up, oh, seven and eight, let's go. Nice. That's a cool mask. I wish I could take it, but I can't. Okay, let me leave before something else happens. This is so typical of me to just shank everyone. Alright, I'm out. Oh my god. I told you. Oh, the enemies. Let me let me skedaddle. There's no way I'm gonna be dealing with way more than what I can handle. I see you were able to find the lockbreaker. Splendid work. Keep it up. Crossing the contract. Okay, so my next mission is somewhere downstairs. V, my dear, I need you to pay a visit to a tiger claw den and retrieve something for me. I know you are up to the task. I am attaching more information. Read it carefully. 
The vulture is the wisest bird. While others lose strength in pursuit of prey, the vulture waits patiently. It only spreads its wings when it smells blood on the air. You will be my vulture, V. I heard a tiger claws casino has been robbed by one of their own, a dealer. The girl had an al alias, Vortex, and she managed the casino's machines. She programmed them to skim a small percentage so a drop from each win landed in her bucket. It took years for the tires to realize how they were being cheated. You can imagine they were not pleased, but their ferocity extended too far. Vortex died during the interrogation before revealing where she stored the stolen money. A vulture is wiser than a tiger, V. You will find it. I will send you the Vortex last known location. Don't let me down. Wow, this a mattress and the water, some hazardous chemicals. Yeah, this is Bridgeport, Connecticut, right here. So, casino heist, so to speak. Oh, shit. Hold up, it's paid to get inside. First time I hear a casino have an entrance fees. Don't agree with it? Then fuck off. No one's forcing you. $1,700? Of course it is. Fuck you, asshole. I feel like I'm being robbed. Mm -hmm. Have fun. Yeah, whatever. Ah, look at that. Um... Your outfit's okay. Your outfit's nice. This is an underground casino. I like this. Search the casino office. Question is, where would this office be? I know that's the server room. Wow, this is a lot of boring people here. I thought this would be, like, a party. Don't even ask. It's Annie's. It's pathetic. Say what you will about Vortex. That's the stairs. Fuck you, asshole. I'm not no bitch. Whore. I'm about to, like... You know what? Grab, and I'm gonna do a non-lethal takedown because you know. Oh, oh, okay. She just went through. Okay, that's cool. Let me see what I can find here. Uh, I'll do remote takeover. Now I gotta search the office, so. Okay. <gasps> That's where the office is? Hold on, where is it? I gotta go up the stairs, right? Okay. I guess I found it. Maybe? I know where the office is, so... You got any stuff I can take? Thank you. Alright, let me go upstairs. Oh, the stairs. I forgot. Alright, let me see if I can go through. First of all, now you have a problem with me being here? Come on, man. Generally, so not us. Can I not hack this camera? Turn off. Perfect. And I'll just go in here. Uh, grab non lethal takedown. Next. 
I'm not gonna grab the ooh. Um Are you really standing there? Okay, he's just standing there. So I gotta find the Vortex cred chip. But it seems like hold on, can I do distractions? I like how people are just coming in and out of this office. Thank you. I'm gonna do a grab. Non-lethal takedown, because I am not no murderer. The exit's that way. Um, are you dead? She's just laying there. I don't know what she's looking at, but I'm I'm leaving. My work here is done. Oh my goodness. And I didn't need to kill anyone. This is beautiful. Like this is a truly successful mission. I mean I lost some money, but it's not it's not bad. I know I'm going to gain that all back anyways, when I get paid. Do you even need to make a peep? Alright, let's go. It's on the other side! Oh my god. Okay, you know what? I didn't even need to travel that far. That's good. Pretty convenient. Received information that Vortex's shard is on its way. You did not disappoint B. That deserves compensation. I am closing the contract and transferring your fee. Hey V. Got a serious gig, which means I'll be needing a serious merc. Yeah, I'm here. Want you to hop to Sixth Street turf. Graft a virus onto their tech. Counting on you, champ. Oh, and one last thing. There's this techie, Lucius Thorin. I wouldn't mind if he got a piece of lead to the skull. You dick? Good. Specs attached. Those boys and girls from Sixth Street think they got wicked smarts that they can jump a Militech transport in my hood without me knowing about it. They think they can crack at corporal weapons and tip the balance of power in the city to their favor. It's time they got a rude awakening. I'll snap you the location of the 6th Street hideout and the door code. Job simple. Find a way in. Look for the comp they use to jailbreak corporal tech. Upload the virus. I'll supply to you. And voila. The fancy new weapon melts into a sparkly new sledge. Yep. Wherever that is. One more thing, if you happen to find a Lucius Thornton, do me a favor and make his ass disappear, will ya? Thornton's a techie, came up with this gunk plan, which makes him a real thorn in my ass, pun intended. Stay safe and have fun. One oh, Hacking the Hacker, I just love that name of the quest, that's funny. This is a shitty ass place to live, especially right next to the nuclear waste plant. What type of Fallout 4 radiation is this shit? Yo, 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 my chugos, shroomers, and fumers! Mr. Whitey here! Drop that milk toast kibble and rush to the nearest door for a taste of sweet, sweet, sweet clean speed! Cause life is too short to be slow! This is a very interesting place to live. Oh, they saw me. They know I'm coming. Oh, I got enemies. Look at that. Number one. Number two. 
Ooh. Yeah, I don't care. I am reckless. Number three. Ooh. Ooh. For the union. Number four. Oh shit. Uh brick walk, please. I'm not trying to. There you go. There you go. I am trying not to get killed here, so. Holy shit, this weapon's gold. It's too bad I can't keep it. That definitely would make me very OP, that's for sure. Alright, this is it. Okay. And virus all set. Anyway, it's time for me to jet because I am not gonna stay here and get my ass kicked. You know? Keep pushing! I like how she's just ooh, who's that? Who's in my way? I'm sorry, but I just had to, man. You're pretty, you're pretty much in my way, so. And this gun's pretty heavy, so I can't really run like that. Nice. All right, I need to leave, so. That went pretty smoothly. That's disgusting. So, next week will be a very special episode. I'm not gonna tell you what exactly, but it won't consist of any side missions hey, for a while. Oh shit. Who's waiting for me? Oh my god, bro. Fine. Alright, let's go. Profesh as ever, V. Sixers will think twice before sliding their gunk asses anywhere near my turf again. And that thing with Lucia Thoran? Yeah. <laughs> Cherry on top. Contract Galost. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies and... I'll see you next time.